A Queensland Indigenous Council says it's taking a stand by booting a government-run grocery chain from its remote town. Wurrabinda Aboriginal Shire says prices at the shop are so high that people are driving two hours to get a better deal. This is the only general store in Wurrabinda, but for some locals, the prices here have been unaffordable. Ridiculous. In all honesty, it's too high. We don't, do gross, we don't really do grocery shopping here. Instead, some residents choose to drive two hours to the closest city, Rockhampton, for a better deal. There may be one or two of us will go and do, a, do the shop and then we'll come back. Those who do shop local do it begrudgingly. Um, that's uh, women's hygiene and um, usually it's like half that price outside. A government-owned statutory body, Community Enterprise Queensland, or CEQ, runs this store and 27 others in remote Indigenous communities across the state. On a shop in Wurrabinda last week, the ABC found a bag of rice for $19, a tin of tuna for $8 and canola oil for more than $7.50. Um, no, I don't think it is. I don't think that is acceptable. The local council says it's been asking CEQ to drop its prices for several months. Things like um, nappies, especially the, the disposable nappies for, for children, the, the detergents, uh, the washing powder, um, milk in terms of uh, the powdered milk. We all like to live on corned beef uh, at times. That's one of our favourite uh, foods here that's pretty high. CEQ says it's battling a massive freight bill to get products out to remote communities and that it subsidises the cost of fresh produce. It also says it's been dropping prices on sanitary and baby products at this store. Last week, council voted to boot CEQ and give the store management to a local business owner instead. And I think it's going to make a huge difference to community because prices will be significantly different, uh, lower down. The new management takes over next month. Amelia Turzon, ABC News, Wurrabinda.